This is question number 22 and we are told the number of students in 40 schools in a certain sub-county were recorded as follows. So we have records of the school number of students in the 40 schools, 238 all the way to 830. Uh, part A, complete the frequency distribution table. So there was those schools that uh, are in between 100 and 199. And this is one, this is two, this is three, uh, this is four. So we had four. So you would put the four there. Then those who are between 200 and 249, uh, we may have this one. That is one, 249. Uh, we have, uh, this is another one. Those are two, uh, three, and we have uh, three, four, five, six. So there were six. Uh, then we have uh, those in between. 250 and 8, 9, 10, 11, uh, let's check, 11, uh, let's check, uh, 11, 12, so they were 12, uh, 400 if you count them, uh, the way I have shown, you get there are 10. Uh, those who are between 600 and 799, they are 6. And those between 800 and 849, they are 2. You check, you cross, the, that's how you do it. You check, you cross, you eliminate one by one. To complete this frequency distribution table, we need to make uh, two more columns. Uh, so you make two more columns. So we have That is one column. Uh, we have uh, the other one. So you make two columns. Uh, so here you say it is class width. And uh, here you say it is frequency density. frequency density uh, here you get class width class width you start with the uh, from uh, lower class boundary that is uh, this one is uh, 199.5 and uh, 99.5 so this is zero this is zero this is zero this is one so this will give you a hundred if you compute this is 249.5 minus 1.9 199.5 you'll be able to get 50 here uh, you subtract you'll be able to get 150 uh, here you subtract you get 200 and here you get 300 and finally uh, here you get uh, that is uh, 6 you get 200 not 300 uh, we have uh, 200 and finally we have 50 so the class width are different frequency density uh, we divide the number of number of schools of, fre uh, of frequency divided by the class width so 4 divided by 100 will give you 0 0.04 uh, this will give you uh, 0 0.12 that is 6 divided by 50 
this will give you 12 divided by 150 you get 0 0.08 uh, here you get uh, 0 0.05 uh, here you get 0 0.03 and here you get 0 0.04 so that is a frequency density so once you do that uh, part B on the grid provided draw a histograph to represent the data so the histograph uh, I have put the the grid here we have the frequency density a number of student uh, so we will start uh, like we have computed like we have computed the frequency the class width you can see it is from 99.5 so what we are going to use here uh, we have uh, we already have the number of student so between if you, between if you check from our table here between 100 and 199 the frequency density is 0 0.4 so we can be between 100 and uh, 199.5 uh, the frequency density is 0 0.4 so you say uh, this is 0 0.4 this is they are 10 so it means uh, 0 0.01 0 0.02 0 0.03 this is where we have 0 0.04 and that will be up to there so you you draw a line there then the next one uh, between uh, 200 and 249 it is 0 0.12 so you check here 0 0.12 so this is a uh, and it is from uh, up to here because it is 250 0 .0, 0 0.12 this is 0 0.11 0 0.112 so you have uh, your frequency density there uh, let's do that uh, again frequency density okay the next one uh, is from uh, 250 to 300, 399 and the frequency density is 0 0.08 so what we do there is uh, it is 0 0.08 so this is uh, 0 0.06 0 0.07 0 0.08 so it will be there and it is up to 399 so it will be up to there so you draw a line from there and you bring it down you use your ruler uh, then we have from uh, uh, from uh, 399 to 599 uh, this is a uh, 400 to 499 this is what i'm calling 399.5 uh, so it is 0 0.05 so this is where you put that uh, so that is how you that is how you draw that the next one is uh, the next one is from 600 to 799 so you come and draw your it the, the frequency density is 0 0.03 so this is where we have 0 0.1 0 0.2 0 0.3 and it is up to here up to here so you draw it up to there and finally we have the next one uh, which is uh, 0 0.04 uh, and that is up to there this is uh, from 800 to 849 so it means it will be here and the frequency density is uh, 0 0.4 so 0 0.4 uh, this is 0 0.5 so that will be so that is the uh, that is a histograph to represent the data from there uh, we look at the other questions so the, the part C of the question use a histograph to estimate the median 
Roman number 2 number of schools with more than uh, 350 students so what you do is uh, the median class the median class is 250 to 399 and uh, you say uh, red x equals to point where vertical line dividing the area of histograph dividing the area of histograph histogram into two equal parts intersect at x-axis uh, so we use a formula we say 4 uh, plus 6 into bracket x minus 249.5 uh, you multiply by 12 of over 150 is equals to one a half multiply by 40. if you compute that you find x is equals to uh, that is 7 uh, 374.5 so that's how we work out that but roman number two you say it is two plus six uh, plus ten uh, plus uh, three ninety nine point five minus 350 and you multiply by 0 0.08 and this is equals to 21.96 uh, which we can say approximately 21 schools 21 schools so that is how you get uh, that question uh, if you get to this stage, then you have scored 10 marks.